Oh, is Rachel helping her brother? <laughs> Rachel is so nice. She just helps without me having to ask her anymore. Welcome back, guys, to part 14 of our 100 Baby Sims Challenge. Of our Let's Play Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. Um, things might look a little bit different because I just installed the reshade, um, to my game. Um, from like, that makes it, the graphics like brighter and just kind of look better overall, at least to me. Um, from Urban X Sims. Um, I have the Scorpio preset, so I actually haven't really looked at how it's in game yet. But I'm hoping it doesn't really bog my game down too much, but I added it because, as you know, in like previous episodes, it was really dark in here, and it was like it was kind of dark like all around. But now that I'm looking around, it looks so much better. I like, think just look more clear and more like lifelike. Like look, look at the Sims; like they just look more alive because <laughs> it's bright. So there's a leaf pile over here. Someone wanted to play in the leaf pile. I don't remember who it was, but it's right there. Oh, and there's also this tree. You should probably do that too. If you guys don't know, if you take care of that tree enough, um, it opens up and there's like a secret kind of like lot or secret world inside. But anyway, um, in our last episode, our first baby and our only girl so far, Rachel Rouge, is up into a teenager. So here she is. Um... She definitely probably has her like dad's nose, but I think she is super cute. She um, ended up getting the erratic trait when she aged up. Uh, so I kind of want her to take a, a selfie. Can she take pictures with her brothers, I wonder? Take photo. Yeah, there's no one around to photograph. It's dark in here, but we have flash. Oh, so we'll take two of those maybe. I do want to keep track of that. Oh, look at Reina. Like, even like the sim pictures in the side look really good. Um, what's Rachel's. What's Reina smiling at? It's kind of creepy. Uh, she needs to sleep. Um, what do they need? Okay, you guys do just have to sleep also. Sleep. And where are you? Oh, you're over there too? Okay. Then you go sleep in this bed. Because the other ones are going to sleep. They all just need to sleep. Hopefully soon we'll be able to expand this house. Because this whole sleeping situation is getting pretty rough for them, I'm sure. Um, I'm going to put the leftovers back. Because we aren't going to waste any leftovers. Nope, not on my watch. Not when we barely have any money. Why is this toy floating? Put that away. <laughs> um, so we're just gonna get Rachel fun up. She can also probably like play games on her phone while she's watching TV. And then bounce the web. Um, oh, he's calling Russell. Oh, his dad. No, no. Travis. Oh my gosh, Kareem, go away. What's with all these, like, fathers coming to show up all of a sudden? All just tired. Okay. Your bed's right here. Uh, you can go ahead and sleep. You want- Russell wants to make a BFF. Which I'm thinking is probably gonna be his brother. At least for now. Um, they really also need to take baths. But we only have one bath with eight people in the house. Can you imagine that? Only having one bath, but that's also a shower with seven other people living with you? That's- that would just be too much. Even in like my dorm, sometimes I have a lot of roommates and like it's kind of hard organizing that type of stuff. No, Travis, stop trying to come and hang out. Um, Rachel is taking a sh shower, which she really needs to do. And then I'll just probably send her to bed. I'll probably, we can get her a better bed though. Um, we won't sell this one. We'll just put it in the inventory for later. Um, we also need to check the mail actually. I didn't, I forgot to check the mail in last episode from all the birthdays. Um, so we will get 
a nice tune ish bed for her. Um, this one seems good, I think. Let's see, it seems like a good energy, but isn't too expensive. Um, I guess the middle frame one's good, and then for Rachel, I think something like this probably good. So we'll put this uh, in here. I wonder if I can move it closer to the wall. Um, yeah, that's probably as close as we can get it. But that's fine. So that's good for now. And then we'll put her picture maybe over here with the birth certificate. Or actually, we'll just put it in her room. Um, they both came out normal, it looks like. We'll just put this one up. It's, it's super dark, but that's fine. And then we'll just sell this one. 12 bucks. Pretty good. Um, and now, Rachel, yeah, you can claim this bed because that's yours. And you can go to sleep. Um, yeah, we like. Oh, what's up? Wait, is that in our inventory? Why do we have that in our, in our pocket? That's a waste of pizza. Okay, so Reyna, you should be done in the back. Oh gosh. Uh, oh, Russell tried to be friends with it on his own. It's funny. Okay, so Reyna's gonna go take care of that. Um, you are okay. You can go take a bubble bath since you're awake. You actually Reyna needs to do that first, but that's fine. Um, yeah, I mean, there's a monster. You stink. Why don't you? Why don't you go play in the leaf pile? Since it's oh yeah, we wanted to also, and he already smells. So playing in a stinky leaf pile isn't gonna do much worse to him. Um, Russell is taking a bath. Is he? Okay, good. We're actually getting some painting done. Where's the leaf pile go? Aw. Okay, um, let's see, he scared the monster and he's filthy. There's nothing to even like swim in for him to get that up. Um, yeah, he just feels kind of gross. His brother, how close are you to being done? Not at all. Okay, so let's see. I wish there was like a park nearby, but we'll just have you go ahead and come back inside, right? We'll watch some TV. After we paint this, we're gonna sell it and then cook some more food. So, hopefully, all our other toddlers stay asleep. Speaking of them, we'll do Victor and Vince need to do. Imagination, potty, and thinking. Um, just potty, really, because thinking's almost all the way up for Vince. Um, I think baths take longer. But it's probably like. Like, Russell, you've been in the bath this whole time I was playing outside. I smell, I need to take a bath now. <laughs> Hopefully, oh gosh. I mean, I guess we can make the kitchen smaller and put like another bathroom right here. Um, we don't really need all of this space just for the bathroom. Uh, they have homework. They haven't done their homework either, so we're gonna have to work on that. And then you go watch the TV with your brother. Reyna should be almost done with this painting. Whoa. It's like a, a cat? Very interesting. See, Russell was like, ugh, you stink. And Ray's like, well, I've been waiting for you. <laughs> so I'm gonna have you also take a bramble bath. Um, Reyna, you can sell that. We also got the creativity level three. We're going to serve dinner. Ooh, spaghetti sounds great. And now we have spaghetti. Oh wait, did you only make one? Okay, I was gonna say like, um, right now you realize you have a growing family. Um, can we, yeah, call to meal. Stop eating real fast and then call everyone to the meal. 
Right now, hurry up. I know you're tired. Oh, everyone's coming. Everyone's waddling. Oh my gosh, they're just like, oh, my family, here's some spaghetti. Food goes away like that because we have eight people in this house. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, um, yeah, someone smells, but what we'll figure that out later. Um. Oh, Anthony up to motor, motor level two. There's Rachel. Um, she wants to talk. Yeah, she wants to talk to her mom. It's probably with me right now. We will tell her inside the story. We will compliment our mom as mom. She's doing a really great job raising all of us. We'll discuss her uncomfortable mood. Put this away. Okay, so they're eating. Um. Just looking at that. So Vince and Anthony are talking. That's cute. At least they're all not hungry anymore. Um, which is getting spun up with this great. Uh, Wild didn't thinking up with this fantastic. So I think everyone had something to eat. I mean, at least mostly. Victor's gonna have to eat. Oh, Anthony had to level three. That's great. Ray's sitting with his mom and older sister, his only sister. <laughs> Put this away. Everyone's just bringing their plates back. And kind of, now that they're done, uh, I can't even talk to so many people in this house. Um, we're gonna spend some time with our children, which is pretty good because she's been so busy sleeping and cleaning and teaching. She hasn't been able to really do that lately. Put this away. Oh, this is all. They're so cute. Rachel and Raina. Gonna be. Her face is like all in her hair. They have like the same hair. Look at Ray. This is a good picture. <laughs> um, someone didn't finish. Probably Vince's. Um, oh, it looks like he's gonna go eat now, though. So he, you want to talk with Anthony? That's Antoine. Where's Anthony? Oh, there you are. Um, put this away. Oh, we can't yet. Okay. So does Anthony actually need anything? Oh, he needs a bath. Oh yeah, okay. So we're gonna give you a bath. Rachel can do that now, which is super, super helpful. We get a double bath to Anthony. Also giving their little brother a bath, it's so cute! Um, Victor's just holding his plate. Like, can someone take this away from me? Oh, he's watching. Oh, he's watching little little brother do his own work. Mm. Um, why is he putting his plate down? <laughs> Antoine is doing good. Victor, you should practice going to the bathroom. So go ahead and do that a few times. You still have the plate? Where's the plate? I don't see it. Um, like, that's not where you sleep. Just spray them off front of the bed so they they can calm down. <laughs> um, Antoine got the imagination still here. Now what the fuck? Where's Vince? Vince wants to go to sleep, but he also needs to get his party up. So we're going to go ahead and do that first. Um, Anthony is dancing because now he's clean. <laughs> um. Oh, is Rachel helping her brother? Oh, Rachel is so nice. She just helps without me even having to ask her anymore. Um, and now Russell's on his homework. Russell's probably like, thanks Rachel. Thanks big sis. So you can go to sleep now. Aw, Rachel's like, thank you mom. I don't know what I would have done. You do your homework now, right? <laughs> What is your party still at? Go party a little bit more because you're because after that, after the party still, like the thinking is like right around the corner. I think Vince and Victor will be able to age up in the next episode actually because they're super close. Um, go party a little bit more. Why is Antoine crying? Oh wait, is he hungry? 
Oh, he was the one I didn't eat. Okay, I knew one of the kids didn't eat. Something was unaccounted for. Um. Oh, he wants to hug his brother. Okay, so let's see how Vince and Victor are doing on the party. Okay, so, um, Vic Vince is getting closer, and Victor is close behind. We'll probably have to help them more tomorrow. They are getting tired. I don't want to keep forcing them. Bray is going to sleep now. Did he finish his homework? He did. Good job. Rachel is going to do hers. Um, why aren't you eating? Eat the spaghetti, Antoine. You're hungry. Anthony is playing with blocks. Um, we need to work on uh, imagination now. So go ahead and make it this and babble. Uh, Rachel is still doing her homework. At least Raina gets to sleep now so that Rachel can help with the other things. Victor still has to play. He's wandering around, and he was almost level four, so I might as well just let him finish that. Um, can I like debug him because something is weird? He keeps putting the plate away, but there's no plate, <laughs> so I don't know what's going on. Um, yeah, and then Antoine will eat for some reason. Okay, let's see. We don't have our homework. Anthony has level 2 and communication is great. We're gonna check. Rachel's gonna check on her little baby brother, Antoine, which is the youngest one. And hopefully, she'll be able to help him actually eat something. Um, nope, she's gonna get the easel for some reason. Okay. Um,. You are tired, but you're also hungry. I don't know why you didn't eat earlier. I'm going to have to... You can just make them pass out. <laughs> That's so sad. Okay, let me... I think it's control to see. Just, I, need, I just need to de debug him. Because something isn't right. So we debug you. Something else was going on that was weird. Oh, it was Victor. We'd Debug you also. The, there's the plate. Okay, now I can turn that off. Testing sheets off. Okay, so I just have to fix that. That should be a problem, hopefully, for the challenge because they weren't actually doing anything. But now Anton should be able to eat, and now Victor won't be holding a plate everywhere he goes. So go work on your fun. Um. Rachel, can I talk to you, Antoine? That's cute. He won't take his clothes off. We're not going to do that. Um, Rachel is so, so caring for her younger brothers. She's such a good big sister. Um, yeah. Right now, she's feeling happy, at least, with her erraticness. I'm very sleeping on her bed. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I feel like it's everyone loves Rachel. They love their mom also, of course, but like, their big sister Rachel is the number one, man. Um, Victor, you should go to sleep also. Oh god, what's there? Oh, it's Harvest Fest today. All of a sudden a bunch of gnomes came up. Look how fast Victor can run now. Oh my god. Um, okay. So that's interesting. Ray really likes to play with the toys. <laughs> um, he needs to spin up anyways. He needs to, to sleep. I guess, yeah, he'll need to take a nap. We're going to, hopefully we'll be able to take a nap before we go to school. <laughs> Poor Rachel. <laughs> um, but at least now we have food. Go take a nap, Ray. Because you did get your homework done. Did you have to do your homework? Oh, yeah, he did. Um, and then we'll have Russell use the bathroom too, so we'll put that in the fridge. Um, hopefully they'll be able to sleep enough 
for going to school today. Actually, are they gonna be level A? Oh wait, the rest of us have a school for level four? Wait, do, do they even go to school today? It's a holiday. I actually don't know if they go to school on Harvest Fest. I think they do, but we all have our social for level three. We should just get that done, actually. So we're gonna go ahead and wake up. We're going to use the bathroom. Um, is, is browsing kick on the website something that raises up our social? Actually, we can talk, right? We can talk to you, tell a story. Um, yeah, I don't think it does, but Russell's just gonna go ahead and do that. I don't know, I don't think they go to school on Harvest Fest. Oh my gosh, there's more gnomes. They just keep popping up. Oh gosh. Okay. So, let's see. Ray is still pretty tired, but he's doing okay. Uh, we need to get Anthony a bath next. Vince really needs some fun. But at least they're not on here. Um, let's see. So we're gonna get Russell's communication to level four. I mean social. Yeah. That's one that's easiest for them, it looks like. Is, does this actually help? I can't even tell. There's a toy in here? Okay. Oh, wherever it is, he's putting it away. Um... Yeah. How are you doing? Oh, from being a charmer. I guess I don't go to school today. Okay. Well, in that case, guys, I'm gonna end the episode here. Oh, someone woke up her charge with like, oh, my baby brother. And she doesn't even get upset about it. Um, I'm gonna end the episode here. In the next episode, we will still have a great harvest fest. We will work on getting, getting Russell's social to level four so that the next time that Ray and Russell go to school, they'll be able to come back as A students and then we'll be able to ace them up into teenagers. Um, which is already like pretty good on track so far of getting at least her maybe it'll be her cooking school that we get up i'm not quite sure yet but then also vince and victor should also age up in the next episode because they really only have like thinking and party to level up um for vic it's also imagination but we're getting there and then hopefully then we'll be able to get to anthony and antoine um, social is pretty easy for them to get up on their own, but everything else is kind of a little bit behind. But, you know, with the shader, everything looks super nice. It's a lot more bright inside, which I'm super happy about. And, yeah, don't forget to put down some baby names, because even though we aren't currently pregnant, um, I always keep track of the baby names and keep those in mind for when we do. Um, because sooner or later, Rachel's going to move out. Which is kind of sad because she's our first child and her first girl. She's been super helpful, but we have to keep this going. So, I will see you guys in the next part. Thank you guys so much for watching my Sims 4 Let's Play 100 Baby Challenge. And I will see you guys soon. So, this is where we cut.